Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, my fellow YouTubers, Facebook, and Zary's here with a video. Usually I do it with a better top. Anyways, I'm sick. Ugh. Ugh. I'm sick. I'm trying to get better. Anyways, I'm doing a video review here today on Living Simply and Fun called The Complete Idiot's Guide to Fly Fishing. This is basically a knockoff of, of, of the uh what do you call it the the dummy series basically this is like instead of the dummies it's idiots now i gotta tell you it's pretty interesting so let's get down to the topics first one is why fly fishing and why do it uh then it goes gearing up uh, gearing up isn't bad but it isn't great more essential accessories it's not a four letter word uh, talking about the knots, uh, casting basics, the forward cast, uh, beyond casting basic, just add water, on the water tactics, where and when to fish, and when, uh, when and where to fish, like a fish in water, when the fishing slow, icing on the cake, hooking, playing, and releasing fish, part four is the fly, part of fly fishing, hooked on flies or flies on hooks, etymology, the basic food groups, fly selection, how to tie a fly and then it goes uh, a few more patterns to tie some more delicious recipes uh, that means fly fishing making flies the trout family the, part five is the freshwater fish you got the trout family salmon and steelhead the bass family big mean and ugly that's like pike muskies pickerels walleyes and carps and you got panfish then you got salt water is what to bring where to go and tides to fish, what to use and what to do. There are more fish in the sea. And it talks about tarpon, sailfish, uh, smaller brother of marlin. Marlin, remembering Santiago. And then it goes barracuda, bonefish, bluefish, stripers, redfish, spotted sea trout, snook, shark, tuna, snapper, mackerel, and jack crevel. Glossary resources and fly fishing associations and indexes. This book was really interesting. I read it in no time. I found it to be very interesting. Fly fishing is, uh, you know, a hobby of mine. And getting into it takes a lot of time and effort. So I decided, you know, to, uh, uh, you know, uh, so... It is a very good book. Do I recommend buying it? Well, if you've read the idiot one, no. But if you own the idiot one, no. Or I mean, uh, the dummy ones, the fly fishing for dummies, then no. Now, if you haven't, yes, I highly recommend this one. Now, these books here are more trying to be more of a knockoff to the dummy series, but it's also trying to say that they can compete really well. And in my opinion, this book has done more than the dummy series. Why? Because it, it just is. It talks about the fish, what you fish for, where to fish, how to fish. It talks about certain things. Now, the casting on my hand, I have to give the casting still to uh, L.L. Bean because they actually show a guy out there. So, yeah, the casting one takes the cake. So, uh, in my opinion. So, do I recommend it? Yes, I recommend it. Um, highly recommend it full-heartedly. So... That is The Complete Idiot's Guide to Fly Fishing, 2nd Edition. Is it worth the money? Yes. Do I recommend it? Yes. If you don't have a book, buy this book. If not, you can always look for the other guides that I've posted and see where it goes. With that said, please add and subscribe if you like. Please post comments in the box if you like. Please add suggestions, comments, or feedback. And, happy fishing.